Hey, it's just a reading here. Today is March 8th, 2023. And it is currently 3.08 a.m. I'm going to be doing a Pisces reading. I already did my prayer. Pre-shuffle the cards. I did take my allergy medication, so... Yeah. <laughs> a little drowsy, but it's not going to stop me from getting into this reading. Happy birthday, March 8th, Pisces. Only my angels and ancestors are welcome in this reading. This deck is like really big, so better do it like this. When it comes down to shuffle, let me twist these around. Bro. Do these backwards. Hopefully, y'all doing good. Because I am. Or Pisces. You got the Queen of Cups. A healing, loving energy. Somebody who gives they love. You got the Five of Swords. Some conflict. Clarify this five of swords. The eight of wands. Okay, you got the eight of wands communication. Rapid movement. Clarify eight of, uh, eight of wands. Ten of swords. Some type of ending. The pain. Got a lot of air energy. Could be doing a little Gemini Libra Aquarius. The Nine of Cups. Something to, you know, play its part. Something to go as planned with this uh, Nine of Cups. The Two of Swords. You have a decision to make, though. With the King of Swords, you are the authority. You make that final say. At the bottom of the deck is this page of uh, page of Swords. Somebody could be uh, watching you with that Page of Swords energy. Somebody could be watching you from a distance. Clarifying the Queen of Cups. Clarifying the Queen of Cups. The Page of Pentacles. So, yeah, you working on um, your finances with this uh, Queen of Cups. Clarify. Oh, this flew out. The Star Aquarius energy. The hope is here, though. Clarify the Star. This flew out. The Three of Cups is friendship, celebration, happiness. So with this Queen of Cups, you are the Queen of Cups. And um, here go this star energy, Aquarius energy, some uh, hope and, you know, good fortune coming your way. And then you have this Page of Pentacles. That's that manifestation that's coming in. So everything is going good, probably financial wise. You know, you probably may be opening up your own business. Probably got something going on online. New job, because the celebration is here. Something may be coming in for you with that. Um, if it's not right now, because your manifest your um uh, your manifestation is here with that three of cups cups. So something's gonna um come in for you. And then you do got that eight of wands, so clarify the five of swords. You went through some type of conflict, so here go the ace of cups. 
So this is love, some type of proposal. Somebody may come to you with that. Clarify this Ace of Cups. Yeah, it might be a rebirth or something. But judgment is here. A new chapter. Forgiveness. You may have went through judgment. Clarify judgment. The Ace of Pentacles. So yeah, abundance. So with this um this five of swords here, you went through some type of um you went through some conflict, some bullshit. But we want to let you know that the um ace of pentacles is here, so abundance is here. And judgment is here. So something's gonna, you know, be awakened. And then you have the ace of cups, so that's love. Could be somebody coming in with some type of proposal to you, like some type of love offer. They're going to be coming in fast with this eight of wands. You might not even know who this person is. They could be in your energy right now. You you know, you not even know it. Clarify this eight of wands for Pisces. Somebody want three of cups with you. Celebration. The magician, though, but they coming in with some type of um, yeah, with this magician card. Clarify this magician card. The Empress. They're going to come in with some type of happy, loving energy. Yeah, this is new. Clarify the Empress. Mm-mm. Oh, the devil. Wait, hold on. This took a turn, okay? You got the devil card here. Somebody can take action with this magician. They have that power. That self-confidence. You could be dealing with a Capricorn or with this devil. Um, hmm. This could be a Knight of Swords you're dealing with. Or this could be you will clarify this not as this I mean not the night as they uh there's a knight of swords and a king of swords. Clarify this king of swords is somebody who who you know don't play. Seven of Wands. Yeah, this gonna be a, this is probably some type of challenge. This is you, you standing up for yourself. Clarify seven of wands. Yeah, because um, you may be in the, he was probably in the Eight of Swords. Feeling, you know, isolated to some, feeling bound to something. Clarify this Eight of Swords.
up. It's the ending of this. This is you. You the king of swords. But you was dealing with something that was really just challenging. You feel like you you basically doing it all by yourself. This eight of swords, that's that self-imprisonment. You know, um, being bound to something, but it's coming to death. It's a new, it's a, it's an ending. Clarify the seven, let me, this ten of swords. The three of wands. Yeah, you leaving this shit behind. Three of wands. What are you leaving behind? Um, clarify the three of wands. Somebody may be coming back. I said the Hoffy could be dealing with a Taurus. This person wasn't on the same level as you. Clarify the higher fact. You believe in certain things they didn't believe in, probably. They was given to somebody else with this Six of Pentacles. Like I said, he could have been dealing with an earth sign. That's a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So you're in higher, you are the higher front. You had to leave this, um, these wands alone and make your own path. So you're leaving because this person could have been given to other people, could have been a third party involved. Somebody was sharing with somebody else. They might want to come back with this. Uh, they probably want this uh, Nine of Cups back. Clarify the Nine of Cups. But I don't think you're going to make this offer with this Six of Swords energy. Because you got the Four of Swords that came out. You need to rest. Yeah, some messages are finna come in with this Page of Wands. Somebody finna send you a message. Clarify this Page of Wands. Mm-hmm. With this Fool at the bottom, they want a new beginning with you. Clarify this Page of Wands and this Fool card. Yeah, the Six of Wands. Somebody finna rush in. They may have some type of good news for you. But you gonna be... St you gonna... Be <laughs> you ain't finna... might avoid the fuck out of this person. Clarify this two of swords. This person probably recognizes that you are what they wanted. The Emperor Aries energy. You changed. Uh, clarify this emperor. The nine of pentacles. Yeah, this is you. You got a decision to make.
Because you and Nine of Pentacles, you are the Emperor. You have the Ace of uh, Swords at the bottom. This is some type of confusion. You rethinking. You're going to have to rethink something. You, this person may have you rethink a decision. Let me see something. Clarify this uh, Nine of Pentacles. This is the three of pentacles in reverse. You want to be alone. Somebody going to come in with an offer though. But I feel like they still giving to somebody. It could still be a third party here. They probably want you and somebody else. They they um looking at you though with this page of swords, they spying on you from a distance. You may, you may know this person could be spying on you, social media, or you know, y'all know each other in real life. They may be they may be asking about you. Clarify this uh, page of swords. Mm -hmm. You letting go of this page of swords. You want something new? There go your energy right there with that hangman. Clarify, uh, hangman. Stay offline out today. The full, yeah, new beginnings. Yeah, it was too much shit going on with this five of wands. With this page of wands. Clarify uh, the fool. And you ain't going for it no more. Clarify the fool. Somebody's going to be rushing in though. They may want to like just talk to you. And apologize. I can see a lot of conflict was going on. Clarify the fool. Yeah, somebody wasn't taking um, accountability for the shit they was doing with this Justice card in reverse. And this King of Cups is you. You know, you was um, dealing with this person and they wasn't giving a fuck. Clarify this Justice card. Libra energy. They finna get punished for their shit or they probably already are. Clarify the justice card. They could be saving their money too with that four of pentacles. I just saw that. Clarify justice. Yeah, because. Mm -mm. And then you got both of these that came out of reverse. You got the three of pentacles and justice. So there was no teamwork with this person. Nobody, they wasn't trying to work. They had you doing all the work. They finna get, the, shoot, they finna get it though. Clarify justice and the three of pentacles in reverse. This 
person could have been greedy as fuck. Look. <sighs> The four of pentacles in reverse. This person could have probably just been like using you for money. Clarify the um four of pentacles in reverse. All in reverse, though, like, no, they're not. Like, that's that's crazy. Here are the four of wands. Yeah, this person was bringing a lot of bullshit. They probably had problems going on with other people too. And they probably still do. What's up with this wand energy? Who is this wand energy? Who is this page spying on Pisces? The Five of Pentacles, yeah. Oh, somebody is broke. Who is this page with this Five of Pentacles energy? Ten of Wands. Yeah, they was a burden. You know, they had too many options with this uh, Seven of Cups. In reverse, too. Shit. This person could really be holding on to their money. Because you got the four of wands. They got a lot of conflict. They had probably conflict with you. They was greedy as hell with that, um, that four of pentacles. And there was no harmony with her. There was no team where this person wasn't trying to work with you. With that three of pentacles in reverse. But justice is here. They finna get uh, karma. Are you getting karma? And um, this person was. Um, didn't have no money. They probably. Um, down on their luck. There was a lot of burdens involved with this shit. There was a lot of burdens. This person ain't for you. And your decision making is. Is. Right here. Ooh, sorry. That medicine kicking in. You're going to have to make a decision. What decision does Pisces need to make with this Two of Swords? Because somebody going to come in. They may need uh, financial help. Clarify this Two of Swords. They're not going to tell you, though. But you, um, you not worried about this shit. Yeah, see, look. The will of fortune. This is all bad. Your decision needs to be worried about you. You need to break this cycle. Seriously, Pisces, you need to break this cycle with this person. This person ain't it. You're good by yourself with this uh, Queen of Wands, this independence. You don't need somebody else, especially when it comes down to this type of attitude that they got. Because the Wheel of Fortune is here. This person's going to come in. It's going to be the same shit. Trust and believe me, you don't want that. You do not want that. You do not need that. Let me get a healing card. This person is not going to be on the same page as you. I feel like they got other people. This could just be 
family or this could be somebody else they get into. Or they could have just been given to a bunch of people in the past. But they're coming back around. They're watching you. Beauty. Focus on your physical health. Your looks are also important. Dealing with self dealing with self perseverance. The outer shell should be well groomed and pampered. So take time out and pay attention to your looks. Yeah, pay attention to yourself. You are beautiful. You are the Empress. You are the high priestess. You do not need this energy right here. Angel cards. This flew out. No. Remain positive. Yeah. Pisces, if you've been um, by yourself, worrying about you, focusing on you, and focus, focusing on what's around you, keep doing that. Because you don't need this stupid ass want energy around you so just stay strong and you'll get through i'm gonna close this reading out goodbye pisces